<laughs> What's up guys, it's ID1. Russia and USSR were producing cars. One of them was Lada, other one was Volgas. And they were pretty cheap. But there was one, uh, there were, uh, there was one car that was even cheaper. The most uh, famous car among the people, it's called Zaporozhye. Oh yeah. Its other name is Zaz, I think 969. And this car apparently is a coupe, which makes it even cooler. Only two doors, one on each side. The second thing, this car has an engine in the back. Yes, the engine of this car is here. And that's why there's like some holes here. <laughs> Not that uh, your luggage get uh, wet with the rain. Here is how it looks at the back. Now this car uh, is the smallest car for, that was produced in the USSR. I think it's even unlocked. I won't even uh, though try. Here's the interior, very simple one. Uh, apparently this car was restored uh, or is just in a very good condition. It has like two seats uh, for, for in front and another couch at the back for passengers. As you can see, the uh, place for the behind the passenger is doesn't is not very big, so you won't fit your legs. Uh. Here is a small quick tech information. Zaz 968M was produced from 1979 till 1944, but uh, the previous model, which was basically the same, was produced from 1966. It had uh, a V4 engine with uh, uh, 45 horsepower and did uh, 0 to 60 miles per hour uh, in 35 seconds. And the maximum speed was around 73 miles per hour. The price of new Zaz was around $10,000 in today's money. So you needed apparently two, uh, one and a half year or two year salary to buy this car. This is the cheapest car in the USSR. I've saw, I say, I've seen like a review of Top Gear uh, of this car, and it has a special for hole for fishing. So there's under the uh, driver there is a hole, so you can sit and uh, go onto the lake when it's frozen, and then you can fish through that hole straight from the car. Now that's a brilliant idea. Here's another side of it. As you can see, there's like a teeny tiny handle so you can open it like these are the handle for the car the wheels are super small and tiny and very narrow here they are oh just look at them yeah now uh, it's an awesome car we still have a lot of them left in Russia and Ukraine Ukraine and Belarus and other uh, ex-Soviet republics Here's the name of it, Zaz 968M. Awesome car. Teeny tiny windscreen wipers. And here's like, which cleans them. Basically, this is a big bonnet where you can fit all your luggage and go somewhere and have a good time. Here's like other sports thing. Now the car is super, 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 no, not fast, but... <laughs> super and I don't think that it's super reliable now most of this car has a very uh, fun uh, funny destiny nowadays it's uh, I think in the countryside and because it's super old uh, youth is riding them and uh, they even have uh, the zipper rogers that cut with a cut roof and they make a cabriolet a drop top from the straight from Soviet era Woo! it's not very safe though okay so yeah that's an awesome car a very cheap and very popular the smallest car from the Soviet era thank you for watching and see you next time guys that was a new one bye